All right, people. I have a problem. We have ourselves a bit of a smackdown. These two things came on the same day and uh, I certainly can't afford everything that's in these boxes. Uh, I'm really excited to open them and I think it'll be really fun to review them to see, um, at least for this month, who sent me the best stuff. Um, I think that, oh my goodness, oops. The camera over. I think that it's a good comparison because we have Trunk Club and we have Trendsend. They are, uh, in my opinion, really similar. Uh, they have a lot of the same brands. I think their price points are the same. Uh, they both send you a similar number of um, clothing items per box. Um, I know that there's 10 in this trunk. I they usually put together about three outfits in a Transcend. And so I'm gonna go ahead and get to opening them. Um, I'll do a separate video. I'll do a video for Trunk Club. I'll do a video for Transcend. And uh, I'll do the final review at the end of Transcend and see which one I think did a better job of styling me. Um, one thing that they both knew um, was that I have a fun vacation coming up with a lot of nightlife um, shows and um, and just you know I I kind of requested fun sexy black I don't know just that's kind of what I was looking for and so we will see what they put together for us for me anyway all right since I'm gonna be reviewing these two I'm gonna give a little more detail um, I've done Trunk Club a number of times now. I think they are pretty awesome. I have a pretty good stylist. Um, I've been working with her so that she can get to know me a little bit. Um, so that's one thing that's very unique about Trunk Club is that you get a personal stylist. You get to communicate with them either by phone or by email or by texting. Or the, I use the app. There's a messenger type of app. Um, you can, uh, I know that I personally, I sent pictures of a number of things that I was looking for, for, for this trip. Um, and also I, you know, uh, was looking for a really nice white blouse for work. So I, I'm able to communicate a wide variety of things that I'm looking for. I sent her pictures of some shoes I was looking for. So, uh, they are out of Nordstrom, so we do know that we're kind of thinking of Nordstrom prices. These are not cheaper items. Um, I've seen people get items as low as like $30, $35, but they tend to be like t-shirts. Um, I'd rather personally spend a little bit more on a unique piece. That's, but that's me. Um, I am going to just go ahead and show you. Oh my gosh, this is big. <clears throat> I'm not going to, since it's not a surprise, um, you, your stylist sends you um, a preview of everything that they're sending you. And you have one opportunity to go, no, not that, no, not that. And I put, I sent three or four things back. Um, and I kind of regret some of the things I sent back. I think that what she chose for me might have been better choices than what she rechose for me. Um, but any, ultimately you don't get to, um, it's not really a surprise. So I'm just going to quickly show you my bundle. Cute stuff. And I have two pairs of shoes. And I'll go ahead and unbox the shoes for you. May as well see the shoes. First ones are Sam Edelson's. And... Somewhere there's probably a note. Oh, here's my trunk club note. Try on the clothes. Hi, Marnie. I've packed your trunk with some great pieces for your trip. A few sexy black tops and great shoes. We don't have some of the exact pieces you wanted. So I found similar, and I don't expect them to send me the exact things. It's more, I, here I pictures that I like style me, you know, put me together, use them as inspiration. 
Um, I love the Vince Camuto jumpsuit and thought it would be perfect for your trip. I hope you love these pieces and enjoy your trunk. Daniela, she's pretty fabulous. All right, so I've never asked for shoes before, but I asked for shoes this time. I wanted to have some um, uh, nude heels. And these look really pretty. Um, the, I do not want heels ever any taller than this. This is my maximum. I hope they're not too tall for me. Um, and the other ones are by BP. And I will go ahead, as I try them on and everything, you'll get to see the uh, prices. I saw the, the picture for these, and they look really cute. I'll go ahead and pop this out. It's a tall, chunky heel with big, wide straps. And she did send this jumpsuit that I think is really cute that these will go with really nice. So that's what's special about Trump Cult Club is that they, you know, you really do have somebody styling you and I really need that. <laughs> I need help. <clears throat> All right, so I'm not gonna pull each and every item out. I will go ahead and try them on for you and then I will come back and let you know what I thought. All right, I tried everything on and I'm exhausted. All right. Here is the first item. This one, I am in love with this shirt. Um, really, other than having something fancy to go to on this trip, I don't know when I would wear it. But it's off the shoulder. Okay, this material, it reminds me, it, it's so Halloween. It reminds me of if you took candy corn and, and exploded them into popcorn. I just, okay, so it's unique, it's pretty, it's fun. The sleeves are fabulous. They're just over the top. This material is um, not too heavy, but it's substantial. It's a quality piece. Okay, I couldn't find the paper. I've lost it amongst all of this stuff everywhere, but I do have it off of the, the, um, the app. And so this blouse is by Halogen. It's a gathered sleeve top and it's $69. And honestly, for the quality of this one, I don't think that's too bad um, at all. So that's the first one. And it might be might be my favorite of every, it was the first thing I tried on, might be my favorite. Uh, let me know what you think, if you like that one on me. Um, the next one I tried on is this really pretty sweater. Um, you can see it's got these really, um, these bell sleeves, but I don't think they're overdone. Let's see, how much are those? It's Chelsea 28. Uh, it's sweater, $69. The sweater material isn't too sheer, but it's still really thin, so it's not too hot. Um, I love the sleeves. Um, I'm not sure if the fit through the waist is the best. Um, but I still like it and it's 69, so not bad, not bad. I could be in a lot of trouble with this box. All right, the next one, <laughs> this one's good because I'm safe on it. All right, when I sent some pictures to um, my stylist, I sent her this velvet kind of tank top um, camisole, and so it was like a camisole, but then it had a little wider straps, and I thought it was really pretty. Um, and she, you know, she doesn't always send everything exactly, and I don't, she doesn't necessarily have access to everything. Um, what she sent me was just kind of a silkish type of camisole that just felt kind of like lingerie, and it just really wasn't my style, so I declined it. And what I got in replacement was this ginormous velvet um, a uh, peplum, um, sweater, and first of all, I don't like peplum, uh, I don't think I've ever told my stylist, I don't think she's ever sent me peplum before, but I will let her know, and that's one of the nice things about Trunk Club is that you can, you know, communicate that sort of thing, please, please, please never send me peplum, 
I am undecided about the whole velvet movement thing. I mean, literally, they're putting it in dresses and pants, and I mean, there is velvet everywhere. Um, I kind of liked it in the tank. I think that kind of the limit to how much I want in velvet on anything. Um, and it's just, it's just too much. I, I, it's too hot where I live. I wouldn't get any good out of it, but, and it doesn't look good on me. And the sleeves, um, because it's velvet, look at, I mean, the ties are giant, you know, great big, the knots like this size, it's just huge. So that one's a no, which is good because can't buy everything in the box. That's insane. All right, the next one that I tried on was this one by Halogen Keyhole Tank, $49, so a nice price. Um, I can't figure out why I don't like it. Um, it fits nice, it's pretty, it's slimming. There's something a little matronly about it. I don't know why. Maybe you guys don't feel that way. There's something about it I don't I don't love. So so even though it's a really, really pretty blouse, I'm gonna say no to that one, which is fine. Um I am looking for, you know, building my capsule wardrobe like people talk about. Actually, I don't have any interest in having a capsule wardrobe in the sense of like paring it down. I just want to make it bigger. Uh, so, but one thing I don't have is uh, a really quality white dress shirt. Um, I had pinned one. This one's similar to the one that I um, sent to my um, stylist. This is Halogen Poplin Boyfriend Tunic, $79. It's too big, it's too boxy, it doesn't fit well. I think it's trying too hard, the sleeves don't work, and while it's a nice quality, it's just, we'll just keep looking. Maybe next time I'll have her send me two or three of them. Um, and again, that's one of the things that's nice about Trunk Club, is you can go, hey, let's, I'm really wanting to try to find that white shirt, send me two or three, yeah, or three or four of them so that I can try and find the one that I want. Okay, the next item, my husband literally laughed out loud when I showed it to him, and I can't even be mad at him because it's ridiculous. I, <laughs> it, it couldn't be farther from my style. I n hate, hate turtlenecks. Um, and a, a turtleneck dress is, can, let's see, okay, I don't have any neck. So you add a turtleneck to it, that's just not going to work. It's not going to be pretty. There's nothing that works about this dress. It's t too hot. It's too... <laughs> it's just... Okay, and the funny thing is that she had originally sent me this... Honestly, I shouldn't have declined it because it was very pretty. I've gone back and looked at it. I should have had her send it to me. It was a really pretty red um, burgundy dress. It was, you know, it just had little spaghetti straps and it was low on the back. So I, um, it had, it went to the knee, but then it had an angled um, hemline. So it was, it was really pretty, but I just could not picture myself in it. It was just a little too sexy. So I wrote back, I'm like, that dress is just too sexy. So I think this is what she sent me in return. It couldn't be less <laughs> sexy. It's the opposite. Um, and that, it might, it, you know, it has kind of an A-line on a different figure, I think, on a curvy figure. It could be really pretty. Um, it's Eliza J, Fit and Flare, long sleeve turtleneck, $98. So, we're good on that one. All right, so, the, uh, and I did try on the shoes with those. And, you know, this, the shoes are really pretty. They are $99. They are about a half inch taller than I'm used to wearing. And I'll tell you what, I'm too old to, um, and I don't mean old as an, I just, I don't care. I don't need to have this type of heel and be uncomfortable all, all night. I want to have a good time. I want to be comfortable. Take take that much off of it and I'm good. I'm used to that. 
Um, but I never trained myself to wear tall heels. I'm five foot nine, and so the idea of adding two or three inches to my height, especially when I was younger, didn't make any sense, you know? Um, now I'm a little bit more comfortable with my height, um, so I wouldn't necessarily mind now. Um, but I never really, so I can't, I just can't walk in them. I'm just not comfortable. And these are fabulous, but they are even taller. Let's see. Yep, another half inch taller. And I think they're so cute. And I'm just going to maybe ask my stylist, see if she can't send me one that's real similar, but with about that much. Two inch, two inch heel. Um, and they look great with the jumpsuit, but I literally can't walk. I cannot walk in them. Um, okay, so the jumpsuit. I think it's really cute. And I think that I will consider it. It's $98. It's a little expensive. I think it fits perfectly. And it's comfortable. I do have other shoes that I could actually walk um, around in with them. Um, so let me know what you think of the jumpsuit. Um, I went ahead and put it on um, also with this little layering piece. Um, I found this little white cotton like bathing suit cover up and that's what I um, sent to her. And this is what she came up with for me as kind of uh, in response to that inspiration piece. And so I think it's, I don't know if it goes with a jumpsuit, but I think that it's really, really pretty. And I think I could wear it over um, a lot of different things. And, and they do advertise it here as, yeah, a side slit kimono cover up. And it shows it over a bathing suit, but I think you could wear it over anything. Uh, it feels a little bit like uh, lingerie, and it is $49, and it's by Leith. So I'm considering that. Okay. So, I think that overall, my stylist did very, very well. Some things weren't quite right. That sweater dress was hysterical. I think the jumpsuit was spectacular. I think this cover-up was great. I think the little popcorn off the shoulder blouse is fabulous. The black sweater is pretty good. So, uh, Transcend, you're gonna have to do pretty good to keep up with, uh, with Trunk Club. Um, but it doesn't matter because even, <laughs> I can't afford to buy all of these things. So. Let me know the two or three things that you think I looked best in, the two or three things that you think I should get. And, all right, I will do a little link that goes to the Transcend video where we will do round two of this SmackDown. All right, see you in a bit.